first day of classes for spring semester and what the heck it's like it doesn't feel like today's first day of classes I don't know it's weird I'm headed to campus right now it's like 8 45 in the morning I have two classes today I have a 9 15 and then I have oh gosh a 10 30 the classes are kind of far away from each other though so I only have like a short amount of time to like get like from point A to point B so I guess we'll see how this goes but it is freezing cold outside. I can't show you right now, but there's literally like frost like still on my window. I have this, oh my gosh. There's literally so much traffic. I knew I should have left earlier. I don't know why I thought leaving this late was a good idea. Well, this is great. But I got this giant puffer jacket on Amazon that should keep me pretty warm so i don't know if other places are like this but knoxville traffic lights sometimes just take ridiculously long like for absolutely no reason it's super annoying but if any of y'all don't know i'm a junior at ut and i'm majoring in comm studies in journalism and electronic media so a lot of my classes are like media based and stuff i have a media history class this semester i think that's one of the ones today and i'm actually kind of like really excited about it i love like all the media stuff and like the news and like doing all of that um i'm still trying to figure out like what i want to do post grad exactly because i'm uh, i'm kind of having a crisis right now but we won't get into that but i just think like all the journalism and like media and all of that stuff is so interesting Okay, so there's like zero parking right now. Like there's nothing. So my class literally starts in 10 minutes. Honestly, I'm just gonna have to park in like a staff lot and take the parking ticket because I don't wanna be late on the first day because that's embarrassing and I'd rather pay a ticket than be late. Can I just... <sighs> this literally sucks. The, I could go on and on about the UT parking crisis. It is horrible i mean like it gets better as the semester goes on but still look there's literally is that parking services yes it is i'm just gonna have to take the l probably and that's great love that yep i'm taking the l okay i just parked and now i'm going to i mean because this building i can't get this camera off the building's like five minutes away so it's like not bad but i gotta go so So basically today has not been my day at all. I wish that this was like a fun, like, oh my gosh, first day of school, everything's going so well kind of video, but no, this is just more realistic, I guess. So first of all, we all knew I was getting a parking ticket because I had a parking staff, so here's that. Love, love that. So then I barely made it to my class on time. I made it on time, but class had already started before I got there. So then I had to do like the awkward, like I'm late walk in and like everyone stares at you. Yeah, that one. Um, so then that class gets done and then I have a class on the hill and the hill is like basically just a giant hill with a bunch of buildings that you have to walk up. And it's kind of a pain in the butt to walk up. I will not even lie to you. So I get in the building where my class is supposed to be. I'm even like looking at my schedule, like, okay, this is where I should be. And then I'm down in like this little basement with like all these like labs and stuff. And it's a journalism class. So I'm like, why is this class here? But that's where the syllabus and canvas and my schedule from UT itself says that the class is. So the room that it's supposed to be in, um, is locked and there's literally no one there so I'm like I don't know what to do so I just had to leave like I was like looking on canvas I was like did this class get canceled and I just didn't know there's nothing that says that it's canceled there's literally nothing today is just not my day at all um, but my boyfriend is the most amazing person in the world and he knew I was having a bad day, so he just sent me money to go get Starbucks, so that's what I'm doing. Maybe today will get better, I don't know. Um, I'm gonna email that professor and just be like, hey, look, I tried to show up, but there was like no one here, so like, 
I don't know what to do. Yeah, basically for the rest of the day, I gotta go to work at two for a little bit and then I have chapters tonight, so I'll bring y'all along for that. Oh, you're right out. Thank you. Just got, this is my Starbucks. Oh, it's so good. Yeah, I used to like get actual like coffee and stuff from Starbucks, but then I like had COVID at some point and it just like messed up my taste completely. So coffee and stuff just tastes disgusting now. Keep in mind, I had this like over the summer, so it like wasn't a recent thing. Um, but it just tastes disgusting and it's so bad. Like I don't even want it. So now I get the chai teas, but yeah. Okay, so it's a couple hours later, but I just got back from work and I'm about to head over to Chapter. Brinley's gonna pick me up in a few minutes, but we have formal chapter tonight. And if you don't know what that is, that's like the night where we do like more ritual stuff and we kind of like dress up. Here's just the outfit. Literally ignore my UT sports bra on underneath this. I just don't feel like changing it right now. And I'm gonna have a jacket on anyways because the house is more than likely gonna be freezing cold. So I have this sweater on from Nasty Gal. I've had this since like freshman year. I haven't worn it in a really long time. So yeah, the sweater is from Nasty Gal. These pants are also from Nasty Gal. They're just like these leather, like straight leg ones. Um, I don't know what shoes I'm gonna wear with it. I need to figure that out. Chapter shouldn't take too long so then I can come back tonight and kind of relax because I am exhausted. I'm not even gonna lie to you. And my plan right now is to get up and go work out in the morning before my classes start. I don't know if that's actually gonna happen. I'm really hoping that that does though. I can't be going to bed super late tonight, but yeah. Okay. Is the lighting good? Yes, the lighting's good. All right, good. <laughs> Today is love. I love today. Today is love. <laughs> We're going up to chapter right now. Up a hill. Giant hill. <laughs> yeah, um, getting that calf workout in. You see stuff. Oh, I wonder if Emily's having a night. I need to ask her. Ooh, because they had their like pan hole in it. So I just... Oh yeah, spring recruitment started yeah. today. I was a spring recruit. I was a spring COB. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, there's Bye. house. Look how pretty. Look how pretty she Bye. is. Yeah. Uh, okay, so fever dream moment. So this Mandela gas station effect. on the strip, the pilot, right? This gas station has always been the pilot for literally forever. That's what it is. And we pull in and now the sign is uh, Casey's. I don't even know. Can y'all even see that sign? No, you can't. Never mind. mind. But what is this? The wrong vibe. The what wrong is this? vibe. Where is the tomato, pilot? Tomato, I'm throwing tomatoes. Basically. Ugh. That's so weird. I know. It literally was not like that last week. I swear. I saw the pilot here like two days ago. This needs to be on the not so freaking news. This is like the end of an era. Like this is not okay. See, look at this. That is not, no, no, no. Okay, so that's gonna be it for my little first day of classes. But thank you guys so much for watching and I will see y'all in the next one.